Wednesday. Look, it snows in Florida. See, it's snowing. Uh, when your tank gets low, when, when the liquid oxygen gets low, it forms that on the, on the outside of the tank. Lots of activity first thing this morning. Shears walking in there. Trying to make his way back there, I think. We're getting our oxygen. Three kills. But thank you for all the guesses on the contest. Uh, I'm gonna write them down on, on on the sheet here in a few minutes. All right. So the smoker I've been working on yeah, I just found it. over the past month. Um, when I cut the door out. There's a little gap, so somebody suggested getting a little strip of steel and welding it all the way around. So what I'm going to do is take this to the shear and chop it and chop another section. And then I can use the second section and, and vice grip it and then run my run run run, uh, run my cutter right down so it'll be a nice straight line because you use the factory edge and i'll do that uh four times so uh, that gap won't be there and the, and the smoke will stay inside right. we're going to shear this guy up i found this in our usable steel pile this morning that we resell the shear should chop this it's only eighth inch Should do it. I mean, I've, I think I've done it before. And then we'll cut that little bit off there. We don't need that. And then now we got two pieces that we can use. This over here. Might as well get a little bit of shearing in, right? While we're here. How we doing, Eric? Uh, yeah. On camera too? Of course. Hey, your uh, thing. He was just joking. Now, like people have asked why I don't wear gloves because I like to be able to see where my fingers are on, on this thing. Because with your glove, you have a little bit of play at the end of your fingers, and it's got no, no. I've seen that thing uh, uh, take a guy's hand off before, so I know what it can do. Always respect the machine and fear it. Just went in there. Eric. Yeah, a couple of you have also asked about the restaurant. So we're waiting on my ex-brother-in-law uh, to... Uh, he's got two other restaurants and they're gonna use parts of the walk-in for spare parts. So, and then they also have to put up uh, some type of barrier fence. 
because once you take that aluminum fence down, it's wide open and there's a there's a trip hazard that somebody would eventually walk in there and stumble and then he could get sued. So we're just waiting on him and that to happen and then we're gonna go back. Hopefully we can bring our kids, you know, because they want to help in this. And just be fun and a good memory. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight brass radiators to clean. These all come from the car area. Older cars have brass. So all you gotta do is cut this little pep cock off. Melt it out. Yep, now it's done. This guy's plastic, so you just melt it right here. Or if you had a sawzall, you just sawzall that off. soldered on there. Just a little cardboard. Never hurt no one.
I usually split it right down the middle. I know I lose a little bit more, but it's so much easier to get out than having to cut the whole thing apart. Look at the pretty green. Special effects. <laughs>
We should put it over there. How heavy is it, Kevin? It's, it's just awkward, right? Yeah. Yeah. Over there? yeah, we should probably just go right up and over. Ow. Ready, Nicole? Yeah. yeah. I don't have it. I got it. <laughs> yeah. That goes clean because the screws are stainless, I think, right? Yeah, don't stick. No. So tornado watch right now. Yeah? Till five o'clock. Till five o'clock? Blow my pile away, please. <laughs> that should be the name of my video. Blow my pile away. Yes. Yeah. Okay. That's 12. And then 6. Oh no. No, oh, wait. That's 1.1. 1. 1. 6. And then add that to here. 12. 125, sir and ma'am. We left out of here yesterday. What? Did we leave an aluminum coil? No. We started cutting. It. There was a. And then left. There it. was a piece of copper over there with a piece of brass on on it. So I didn't know if that was from you or not. But I, I cleaned it this morning. It was uh. Kevin, yes. Ryan. Uh, that, and there was a little piece of copper on there. I don't know where. I, I don't know which one it is. But yeah, it was laying right there in front of the. I mean, I wasn't really worried about the aluminum radiator. Either. Three dollars, maybe. Maybe. So, do you think it flew out on the way home, or? Well, it must have. Because you there. didn't leave it here, no. Second. 
you later. You too. All right, bye. I wish we had a... Uh... Can I even reach that? Nope. There's a nice uh, lawnmower up there I'd like to rip apart, but I can't reach it. All right, we'll be back. Here's our other shear baler. I haven't done this in about a week. Just trying to catch them at the right time. cycle probably seven times eight times under a tornado watch until five o'clock but I don't know why because well you gotta shut the breaker off so this is what we're looking at coming through probably in hour hour and a half or so nothing big just your typical afternoon storm and we don't want to forget a pound of Christmas wire. 
with hair that probably made more than than the Christmas wire itself, people. <laughs> oh snap! That... Look at this guy. That's nice. Look at how chunky. Look how heavy it is. Yeah, that's about the same. That's about the same one that I have. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Is it like this? It should have a pull on it, right? It should. On the other side. I think that's the problem. It's got no pull. Yeah, you're missing the whole cover. You're. The, there's a cover that goes right there. That's okay. where the pull cord goes. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe that's why it's out there. That's extrusion, right? Is that, that's heavy. That's is that steel. It's all room in our shit. That's super duper heavy. Yeah, I know. Oh my God. That's all the concrete I poured in it during lunch. Probably. <laughs> Let's check the cracks. This was some type of guard for a machine. I think it was, I think it's a, uh, I think it was a guard. These went on the these. It's the other. Hang on, I got the extrusion, right? Yeah, I'm just putting this up. It was this, it was attached to. Oh, so I what's your guess for uh, this month? So you feel this one? Yeah, that's good. And then they had these two. These are gonna be dirty though. Yeah. These were like, whoop. I think it's a, like a carry-all. So, so what's your guess? Uh, 52. That's already taken. Come on, man. Come on, man. These are all the people. There's another, I see 250. I see a 52 down here. How yeah. come they get a double up? So do you want 52? No. I'll do 51. Okay. 51. We all gotta right. get all that extrusion. Oh. Look at all that good stuff. You know, I've done it all. Out there at the pile. Just give my wire. Oh, get, give me my wire. Just give my wire, man. He's having technical difficulties. This is gonna go as sheet, right? Yeah. That don't go as extrusion. Oh, I one. oh no! Sometimes there's a rod. Nothing good, nothing good. Oh, you missed one. It's a good day out there, right? Oh. This one. Oh, wah, wah, wah. Each one of these. Look at that. Come on. Come on, dirty. That's what I was talking about with that last one. That's what I was talking about with that last one. I was just saying over there, sometimes they have a. Come on! What's up? That's not extrusion. Come on! No. I would never put that in a bale. I would never do, do that. 50.
50. What are you doing with the bike? Heavy. Heavy. Ouch. Is it more of this? There is more of this. Yeah? We throw this in our painted siding bales. Is that all the clean, sir? Half a battery? What did the sealed unit weigh? For what? 22. What? 22. Let's don't forget it's half a battery. Ready on battery? Yep. Dirty. It was buried. Dirty. I didn't even look to see what you made. Huh? I didn't even look to see what you made. Millions. In Mexico. <laughs> look at all that. Where? Oh. You were the one handing it to me. <laughs> they were buried. That won't work. Wait, boy, don't get dirty yet. Huh? The cooler's going to dirty, right? Yeah. I I didn't know if you're doing it. Yeah. You it? What? No. I got too much stuff. I don't need this. I don't need that either. I need to find a hold Six. Hey, you reached your mark. Yep. Oh, leave that wire. Leave that wire. That was actually a nice bike. It's actually a decent bike. I see that. And that's it, right? I, I can add one eleven ninety nine. Heavy, hold on. Great clean job. Heavy light motors, clean aluminum, half the battery, and sealed units, and one pound of Christmas. Where's my hair. And one pound of hair. <laughs> one pound of hair from yesterday. Which Look at these, though, Jeff. A lot of them are long. Oh my goodness gracious. I know. I was like, these will take me twenty minutes to tell. I had a short. Uh, a I do, I'll, uh, you know, I'll do. I'm gonna do a long one. Two oh nine. How how can you tell if a pig is hot? Do you touch it? It's bacon. It's bacon. The factory foreman inspected the shipment of crystal bases ready to leave the plant and approached his new packer. I see you did what I asked. Stamp the top of each box. This side up handle with care yes sir the worker replied i i just what i just to i just to make sure it arrives safely i stamped on the bottom too what i don't understand <laughs> that's horrible what why did humpty dumpty push his wife off the wall his wife yeah so she would fall what so she would fall as you no so so he could see her crack <laughs> he could see her crack what two letters of the alphabet 
contain nothing. Got two letters. O and I. M T. M T. What did Humpty Dumpty's wife say after he shoved her off the wall? Uh, you're a jerk. You crack me up. You crack me up. <laughs> what do you call a man who hangs on a wall? Oh, a man who hangs on a wall? Yeah. Dead? Art. Art. <laughs> uh, what did the lettuce say to the celery? Oh, I've heard this one. Um, okay, I forget. Stop stalking me. Stop stalking me. Tasha? Hi, Tasha. Hi, pretty girl. Are you going to start whining? What do we got, Donna? Well, if the chair stays. Nice and rainy. Oh, nice. Can I plug one of these in just to see the clothes? What's that? Can I plug one of these in just to see the clothes? Yeah. What the hell? That's a GoPro. Wow. Hi, right, Tasha. Look at your pretty eyes. Let me see it. I'm just curious if they kind of do one. I think it's all the way plugged in. Hold on, we gotta go over here. Okay. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Oh, the fan like this? It's on. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, it's not moving. Mode. And no. That won't do that, no. It's burnt out. I don't think you have. I don't think you have anything for me, Donna. It looks like it's all steel. It's all steel. Roar, roar, roar. It's okay. It's okay, girl. Yep, nothing for us today. Quite a beautiful doggy. Huh? What is that? Right. Got to get a bail out finally after our little storm that we had. That was just like about maybe 10 minutes of rain one nice van and the rest is just it's more annoying so i got a poncho out because tying up the bale i was getting settled and i got a bunch of extrusion all done i figured you guys didn't want to see that since i already was on the torch this morning with the radiators We can get a band around that. Oh, that sucks. We got a band. That's all right. Oh. We'll take it to the mechanics area and get a band around that and it'll be fine. Just pick it up in the air and wrap it and band it.
that's what happens when you don't fill it up right. Sure. Here's old Jacob. Yay! Christmas lights, yay! <laughs> Are you doing them all today? Yeah. You're not gonna clean them? Uh, Come on, man. I, can I do a nacho? Come on, man. <laughs> he didn't throw out there, okay, so. Just what we need, more Christmas lights. I bet these work too, like brand new. Well, some of them might just sit down in a brand new box. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, they probably all work. I have enough Christmas lights at, at home, trust me. We do decorate for Christmas. I said we decorate for Christmas. You put lights on your on your house? I put lights on everything. You put lights on everything? Yeah, this is about as much lights as I have right now for my house. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, Clark Griswold. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, hey, every year I gotta do better and I gotta make sure no one in my neighborhood can outdo me. I try and buy something new e each day, or not each day, each year. I try and buy something. Just make sure none of my extension cords are with it. Like that one? Yeah. Now that. You need a bed frame? No. Brand new, still in the box. No, oh, thank you. You're gonna save up your wire for a while? Yeah, I probably got over 100 pounds just in this truck. 100 bucks right there. You definitely said you had some Christmas lights. Christmas light, uh, Christmas tree lights on and off control. What, did you hit up a Christmas store or what? Uh, I just sit in front of someone's house and uh, I almost passed it. You almost passed it? Yeah, because it was uh, with a whole bunch of yard waste. And normally people put their yard waste in like boxes and stuff. And it was green, so at first I was like, oh, it's just yard waste. And then I caught a glimpse of it, like one of the bulbs, and I was like, hold on, wait a minute. So. I'm gonna say 62 pounds, all together. Ugh. Yep, 77. What else are we doing? Uh, anything other than the tide. Come on, man, that's my contest. <laughs> huh? Tires or rims? Rim, rims and rims with tires. Look, I'll go ahead and cut them off when I combine. get them. Oh, look at this. What about that? Uh, this? Yeah. Do you want that? Yeah. Go ahead. Same one I got. That hook. I just picked that up last night. With this. Ah, uh, what? The battery's flashing. They well, it's dead. Okay, that's true. Yeah. I just want you the battery. You got a charger. You just charge up. Oh yeah, at home. Keep this for here. Woo! Bring this home and charge it up. I'll I'll keep that for here. 
so I can blow, you know, so I can blow off the uh, underneath the scale. I don't know if that's supposed to lock in or what. It's only been out in the lane. You couldn't catch on fire, right? No. Never. What about the sink? What all you got in here? Is that a gun bag? What about the sink? Yeah. I know you're keeping this because you're gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna start stripping those. I got you. Now that we got the bail out, now I can dump this. Because I was working today to try and get that. Do you think these lead batteries? Not lead. Those are nickel, cadmium, or lithium ion. It'll say PB for lead. That's the periodic tables. <sighs> that looks like about it. Well. Craftsman? Is that what that is? Craftsman? Yeah. That's so old. Just throw it out there. Just toss it out there. I think that's about it, sir. Ouch. Oh, here, here. Oh, that's heavy. Yeah, hold on. Let me get that. Ten pounds. Yeah, I don't get this. Right down there. Brand new. Yeah. Might have been the wrong one. 30 pounds. 30. All right. 27 bucks, sir. You need to find a appliance guy. An appliance guy like with Nacho and I don't have, the, I don't have all the free time they have. <laughs> hey, hey, man, hey. I gotta get that out before I dump it too. So that's for a friend for his kids. I don't even know how to get it out. That was a pain. 